I destroyed everyone using this Lockman 556 assault rifle in Modern Warfare 2. Check out the gameplay. Just camp in a corner. Such a loser. Stupid. These guys are terrible. This is what was happening to us the last time I played this map. They just got cornered. And they can't do anything. They're stuck in this corner. Don't know how he lives. Damn! Have fun at the gym. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Hope you have fun at practice. Nope. Got a VTOL. Nice. Dude that I'm playing with you, this motherfucker is building. This dude just destroyed the whole lobby. No cap. Hacking, I'm reporting you. Yo, thanks bro, I appreciate it. Bruh, yeah. shit. These guys are so terrible. Oh my god, I feel bad for them. Huh? These guys are the worst. They have no chance. Surprise, motherfucker. Wow, we destroyed these guys. <laughs> Got him! <laughs> I still love this stuff, baby. Too easy. 25 kills. What's up, big Al? How you doing, bro? One more game before I go to the gym. Yo, my KD was 6.25 that game. We completely annihilated that team. So this Lockman 5.56... Assault rifle is absolutely broken in Modern Warfare 2 right now. So, in order to unlock this gun, first you need to level up the battle rifle version of it, which is the Lockman 762. You have to get this to level 13 in order to unlock the Lockman 556. And uh, the battle rifle one is pretty terrible, so uh, good luck getting it to 13 because it absolutely sucks. But once you do unlock this gun right here, uh, it absolutely shreds in Modern Warfare 2. These are the attachments you want to be using for it. So for your muzzle, I like using the Echo Line GSX. You can go with the Echoless 80 if you feel like the damage isn't good on it, but you're sacrificing ADS speed here, which is kind of not great in uh, multiplayer since people die so quickly and you have to aim in before them. So I like to go with the Echo Line GSX. All I lose is damage range, but I get the recoil smoothness that I like and the sound suppression. And then for the barrel here, I'm going with the 15.9 inch Lockman right here. It gives us bullet velocity, damage range, recoil control, and hip fire accuracy. The hip fire accuracy doesn't really matter, but we're just aiming for that recoil control and damage range and bullet velocity, which is really helpful. And then for the laser here, we want ADS speed because it's important. So we're using the Slager, Schlager, PQ Box 4. It gives us ADS speed, which is nice. And then for the stock here, we're going with the RAPP762 Factory. It gives us aiming stability, which helps out a lot. And it doesn't take away from ADS speed, which is really what we're trying to keep here. And then finally, for the underbarrel, I'm using the Shark Fin 90. It gives us aiming idle stability, which is really helpful to control our gun. So yeah, these are the best attachments for my Lockman 556. I absolutely destroyed everyone in the gameplay using this gun and I really think it is an excellent gun to be using once you can unlock it.
So if you find this video helpful, please subscribe to the YouTube channel. Check me out on YouTube Live. I stream there. And uh, I also stream on TikTok Live if you want to check me out there too. And uh, thanks for watching. If you have any comments, questions, or concerns, leave them in the comment section below and I'll try to answer you as soon as I can. Thanks for watching. Peace!